Hello, in this chess puzzle, there's one move for white that will get you a mate in two. Any other moves will be a mate in three or worse. This one was created by W. Atkinson in 1878. So you've got the black king with their six pawns, but he's sort of surrounded by the queen, rook, bishop, knight, and the other knights ready to move in. So it's white's turn. Can you see the checkmate in two for white? Promoting your pawn to a queen doesn't get you a mate in two, unless black does something like take your rook with their pawn, in which case you can check mate in two with your queen. But black can save the mate two by taking the rook with their king or the knight with the pawn, and then you can move the queens in just for a mate in three. Moving your queen to d2 won't get you a mate in two, unless black does something like take the knight, then you can take back with your rook with a mate in two. But black can take the rook or move the king to c6 to save the mate in two. If the king moves to c6, you can promote to a queen, forcing the king to move back. And then you can mate by moving your queen to e6. If the king takes the rook, you can just get a mate in three by moving the bishop or promoting to a queen. The king can't move here, so if the pawn takes the knight, you can check mate in just three with the queen. Moving your rook to c3 is only a mate in three. Black king can take the bishop. You can then move the queen over to check the king, but the king has an escape square. And then you can move the knight to just checkmate in three. Withdrawing the bishop to c3 isn't a mate in two, unless black does something like take the rook with their pawn. So then you can do the reveal check with the queen by moving the king. Black has a single saving move by taking the rook with their king. They can't move here after you slide the queen over, but then you can move in for just checkmate in three. Okay, let's have a look at the solution to this one. So pause the video if you need some more time. To get the checkmate in two for white, you need to move your pawn to c3. If black advances their c pawn, you can then move your knight to b6 to checkmate in two. If black decides to take your rook with their king, you can then move your queen to a2 to checkmate in two. If black moves their king to c6, you can then move your king to f4 to do a reveal checkmate in two with the queen. If black decides to take your rook with their pawn, you can again do the reveal check with the queen to checkmate in two. And if black decides to take your knight with their pawn, you can then move your rook to c5 to checkmate in two. That's it for now. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.